Hello darlings and welcome to day nine of 12 days of lipstick. If you're new here, I'm Raven and you need to go check out the other videos in the playlist. Make sure to do that. Today we are doing a higher end product. We are doing the MAC Retro Matte Liquid Lipstick and I'm using the color, Woo! it's so pretty feels so grand and I hope I feel very grand wearing it. Mm. So if you want to see me, I slap this stuff on my face and follow me throughout the day to see how it wears, see how, if it wears down, all the things that happen with liquid lipstick, just to keep watching. <laughs> Thank you so much for sticking around. Let's get to it. I have mentioned in a previous video that I have had some gripes before with MAC lipsticks, in particular the infamous Ruby Woo. Beautiful color. Horrible formula. Horrible. So horrible that it really, like, ew with MAC for the longest time. But I happened to be in an airport that had MAC and this caught my eye and I thought, let's give it a shot. So let's give it a shot together. Mm. I have already exfoliated my lips, so we're just going to get right into it. I am in a little bit of a hurry this morning. Mom told me to be ready at 930 and then at quarter to nine she was like, let's go. Don't expect miracles. Alrighty, pulled it out. It's a little messy. So we're gonna wipe some of that off. Fingers crossed. Feels pretty lightweight so far. Can't really even feel that I have it on my lips. Alrighty, well, let's do the corners. I tend to, in my everyday life, stay away from doing the corners but because I feel like I get a lot of wear there and a lot of bleeding there, which I would rather have nothing in the corners than bleeding out from my corners, but for testing purposes. There we go. Can say that it is not moisturizing at all. I mean, it doesn't feel overly drying or painfully drying, but it's it's a matte, it's a liquid matte. So, um, you know, what do we expect? The color is gorgeous. Doesn't really go with anything that I'm wearing because I'm still in my house coat. All right, does feel like it's dried down. It dried down pretty quickly. It's, yeah. Uh, just slightly. Not too bad. Okay, I better get dressed and get on with my day. I'm gonna go bake some cookies and decorate them and have some fun with my mom and her bestie. So I will check back in throughout the day. Stay tuned. Let's decorate cookies. This is my abstract, abstract. That's what we're going with, snowflakes, that one leaves a little something to be desired. Mom's working away on some candy canes. She had to destroy some evidence on the first one. It was pretty bad. Here are the trees. I thought you were doing your lip program today. I will. Not video on me playing. Oh, uh, you're doing great. Art. Hey, the kindergarten art is fun. I think so. All right, it is about 11 o'clock and, um, whoa, I thought by sitting next to the window, that would give me decent light. Let me back up. Mm. Yeah, there we go. It is about 11 o'clock. I've had it on for, woo, 
Damn. Uh, I've had it on for about two hours. Looking pretty good, feels pretty good, doesn't feel too drying. I do have that line, but um, that's true with any liquid lipsticks. The corners have worn off. Still feels really comfortable. Can't really tell it's on my face. So, so far, I'm a happy, jeez Louise. So far, I'm a happy camper. <laughs> Yeah, beat it. Two besties in the kitchen. <laughs> Giving each other grief. Never. Always. <laughs> so, Mom, tell us what you're doing there. Making poor man turtles. Poor man's turtles? Poor man's turtles. <laughs> she has taken all those pretzels and unwrapped a ton of Rolos and is now putting the Rolos on the pretzels and we will show you what happens. Oh, look, there's more. Okay, and she's gonna melt them. And then on top goes- On 250. At 250. For about three or four minutes. Yeah. And then we place- I don't know if I've got your- Have, whole, I don't know what they're called. Pecans on top, not broken ones, pretty ones. Pretty ones. And then- Because poor men need pretty turtles. Men, yeah. Absolutely. And uh, that's going to be super cool. And I will show you more when we uh, get them out of the oven. How's your lipstick? <laughs> I don't know. So it is 12.30 and I've had this on for about three and a half hours. There we go. That's the, well, uh, the struggle for lighting is real. Still looks great and it's pretty damn comfortable. After my previous MAC exp lipstick experience, I was not incredibly optimistic, but um, I'm liking it. I'm liking it. A little bit of wear. Not bad at all for three and a half hours. I'll keep you posted. Okay, so there's help with this. I can't help, I'm too busy filming. Oh, we're adding nuts. Yeah. And kind of smush them down. Put the, um, they're not easy. Hey, she's just taking those pecans and working really quickly and, and them? shoving them and squishing, squishing them down. Squishing them down, yeah. On. And they wiggle. To yeah, the thing. so. You, Kind of, it's kind of a two-hand process. All right, I'll stop filming so I can help out. I have no idea how decorating cookies can be so exhausting. Woo! Those are the very last two. There we go. A little overview of some of the cookies that we've done today. been a busy day so it is about 2 40 and I've had this on my lips for about five and a half hours and it does it has dawned on me that we've kind of taken a turn for the worst hey that is I mean it's not like oh my god horrid and it is five and a half hours since I've been wearing this so that's pretty damn good so no complaints I'm actually really really shocked at how much I have enjoyed this one. I was a little skeptical, um, but I'm glad that I've tried it out and have been keeping a really open mind. But I just wanted to put that out there that um, that, that, that is happening. I'm not home right now, so I will wait until I get home to reapply. Hopefully that'll be within the next hour and we'll go from there. So there's my check-in for that minute. See you in a bit. Totally just realized that in my last video I had frosting on my nose so that's what that was hello again it is about 4 p.m. so I have had this on my lips since 9 a.m. so we are looking at about seven hours 
uh, which is a pretty freaking long time, especially considering I have not reapplied at all. I know I said that I was going to reapply as soon as I got home and spoony issues just got in the way of that. And I'm feeling now like I don't even want to reapply. Um, here is where we are at, at seven hours. Not incredibly fabulous, but seven hours I mean, what did we expect, really, you know? Uh, there is some transfer, but not too much. More so around, well, where I guess I still have lipstick at. Um, the reason I am not going to wipe down and reapply is really because this it has gotten uncomfortably drying. And in my opinion, I my feelings are I just want to wipe it off and put on some lip balm. Not the most drying I've ever dealt with, um, but just kind of your average, normal, what you expect from a liquid, oops, what you would normally expect from a liquid lipstick. My opinion of this has changed from what I perceived it was going to be, and it is a lot better than what I thought it would. Uh, so I'm very pleasantly surprised and really happy that I gave this a good shot and gave MAC another shot. Uh, I don't believe it's the best liquid lipstick out there, especially liquid matte, um, but it really does hold up. I will be reaching for this on days, not like when I'm going to work or not all night excursions, but if I'm leaving the house for four hours or less, heck yes, I will totally, heck yes, I will totally be reaching for this. The color was fabulous. I love the matte finish. Wasn't too drying in the beginning. It really only started to get dry around four, the four hour mark, which I think is pretty darn good. So for a higher end matte lipstick, this one really, um, I'm pleasantly surprised. I'm happy with it. Huh. Even though I am saying, oh, it's drying and I want to take it off now, it really kind of, it's just, it's your standard dry. Are there better? Yes. Are there a lot worse? Absolutely. So again, this was in the color Feels So Grand. And it gets my stamp of approval. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I really, truly appreciate it. If you like what you see, please do give it a thumbs up. Don't be stingy with that thumb. Don't forget to check out the playlist down below where I have all of the videos in the 12 Days of Lipstick posted, or at least the ones that I've already filmed will be posted there. Come back and see me tomorrow where we are going to do another drugstore lipstick and see how that goes. Have a good one. Happy holidays. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.